that. I started something I can't <laughs> I can't put out now. <laughs> <laughs> it's too spicy now. Yo, hey, listen, yo, sometimes that's like getting an I, I equate everything to basketball, bro. It's like getting a nigga going and then you talk your shit and then that nigga start shooting from half court and you're like, shit, alright, fuck it. What I'm gonna do? Damn. But yeah, these niggas is always fucking late. Oh yeah, let me uh Jason, Dame, oh, all that. Oh yeah, he thought you he thought you had the bug. That's oh, what it is. Bad. But yeah, these niggas always late. And they always talk to you. I just saw this dot come across my head. Holy shit! I'm saying, always they always late, and then they got they talk shit about me. Mm. Fuck the both of y'all, mm. the both of y'all. All right? Cool. I didn't have to say that. Okay. Man, you're always the first one. I know, hello. No one would. I bet you no one out there would expect. That. Never. They would think I'm the late one. Yeah. I don't know why people would think I'm the late one. Why do they think I'm the late one? Because you're the toxic one. So because you're toxic, yeah. that means you would be late? Yeah. Late late like booty calls. So you always come late. Ah, I do be late to a lot of things though. Mm-hmm. I'm not gonna front. I do. Saying I be late to answering the phone. But you know it's important. You know. No, but this is my saying. So when it's important like work and this, I'll be on time. Mm-hmm. Everything else, eh? Check your time. Mm-hmm. Oh, come on now. Oh, I'm Jamaican. We have an internal clock that's broken. <laughs> so anything that says, oh. That's all Caribbean people. Yeah, but no, Jamaicans are worse. Party starts at 10, you get there at 4. You know what I'm saying? 4 in the morning? Yes. <laughs> that's like, that's a natural thing. Hey, that's wild. <laughs> no, bro, hey, I, I swear to God, that's, that. that's a fact. <laughs> Listen, you got to be there, right, so everybody see you. Hey, you gotta be the last person to walk in so everybody sees. Let me tell you something. If I throw a party and it starts at ten, nigga, you better get there by midnight at the latest. <laughs> it's come to thirty, my ass is in bed. Oh no, nah, all this shit's wrapped up. Like, Listen, <laughs> man. But you know, as you get older, you get better. When yeah. you're younger, you gotta walk in stush. You know what I'm saying everybody mm-hmm. gotta see you. You gotta be fly, flossy. You know I'm saying that's how that's how it is. Mm-hmm. Cause you can't redo an entrance. That's the number one thing. When you're walking into a party, a spot, a function. You can't redo the walk-in where everybody's like, oh, who's that? Who's that? Who's my that? pops who's is that? like that, yo. Like, my pops is, like, the number one of, like, gotta make that late entrance. And that should be pissing me off because, like, he would make sure, like, he'd be on our asses. Like, About be being like, on time. Like, being on time. Like, always on our asses. Like, even for family events where, like, all of us had to go, right? Mm-hmm. We all get dressed up or whatever. My dad's sitting there watching the football game slowly, like, taking 20 minutes to put on a tie. Mm-hmm. You know, I'm just sitting there. We're all looking at this nigga, like, you told us to be ready Cause An hour Fashionably ago, you ain't even This ready. fashionably late Then it's fashionably Fashionably late I'm gonna blur your face out Alright Fashionably Fashionably late You know what I'm yeah. saying there's, there's levels And your pop is fashionably Fashionably late And yeah. it's swag You know yeah. what I'm saying I'm not gonna lie though Like it works It works for him though It does Cause the, the people love him yeah. You know what I'm saying Cause they're like Oh there he go Yeah that's the dude he walking. How you doing? Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah, yeah, that's how it was. The minute, like the minute we showed up with the fam, like he would just dart away from us mm-hmm. and then like, like and then start dapping people up and shit like that. Like gold, we gotta show up. Your pops probably got a little Jamaican in him. That's why. Wouldn't oh, surprise me. You yeah, I'm saying. We, I think we, we. I think we a little Jamaican or a little Haitian. One of the two. You got you got it in one there. One of the something. two. I think it's one of the two. There's something in there. I'm saying. Yeah. Because back, oh, back when I had dreads, everybody used to be like, oh, yeah, you look like Wax Left John, and you definitely look Haitian. Everybody used to say, like, yo, you definitely look Haitian. You know what I'm saying? But you... I'm tight you got. Well, they won't know. You, the dreads is like, ah, but then when you cut it, it's like, ah. Yeah. I you did a drastic change. It's not yeah. even like, you say, yeah, I'm going to get a little fade. I'm going to get a little tape up. Nah, no, nah, it's just like, I'm going, I'm always like, all, it's all or nothing. Like, it's, you're going to have like a long flow and lots. Fuck it. Or it's going to all be gone, bro. Cause let me tell you something. It. Going balding with locks, that ain't the wave. Bro. Oh no, nah, you look <laughs> nuts, bro. Like <laughs> they look yeah. nuts, bro. <laughs> and I want. It's like a, and there was a reason why every time you saw me with dress, I had a hat on because okay, I was, it was starting. Back. It was starting. Yeah, it was starting to look nuts, bro. I was like, uh, mm. nah. I was starting to happen with my uncle. Uh, <laughs> I started. And I see those. And you know what's going? I see those dudes on the train every day, man. And I'm just like, bro, you just give it up, man. It's all right. <laughs> Just come on home, baby. Just come on home. Because <laughs> what you're doing ain't only up and up. It's just not. That's crazy. It's just not. If you got to put something on your head, then then it's time for it to go. Damn. Damn, bro. 
Oh, I got a tattoo too. First tattoo ever. Really? Yeah. It says black. Right there. You know what I'm saying? Did you forget what you want? Yeah. No. <laughs> no, because what I wanted, what I wanted was um. I'm just fucking with you. I wanted the word black, and then I wanted to put the cover. I'm gonna get the copyright sign right, right over at the top, mm -hmm. because you know they. White people, well, people in general love to steal black people's ideas, their mm. color, their culture. Mm. So what I'm saying is, this is my black, you can't copy, you can't steal this, it's mine forever. Mm. That's why I really got it. Yeah. So the, the idea of it was to be, you know what? Mm. You could take everybody else's shit, but you can't take my shit. Mm. This is Bari, Bari's, this is Bari blackness. I'm still trying to figure out, I've been wanting to get a tattoo for like two decades, but mm. I still haven't figured out like, what what I what I exactly for me it doesn't have to be something super meaningful but it has to be something I want to look at forever forever you know what I'm saying that's it. that's on your body mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying and I the shit it hurt mm -hmm. but it didn't hurt as much as I thought it would because everybody's like your right hand don't hurt and it didn't hurt so he did the A and the C because it's in the dead middle of the whole shit I made, yeah. so it did I was ah okay all right but it wasn't bad so I know when I do. Half my chest and my arm, mm -hmm. it won't be bad. Yeah. It's one of those things where it's like, I always, I've always wanted to do it, but then it's like, every time I save that money to do it, there's always something that's a higher priority. You know what I'm saying? That's my like, goal. Bro. That's it. That's the that's the thing. It's like, I really have to be like super set. Like I got almost everything I need, and then I'm gonna get this done. You know what I realized you got to do too, mm -hmm. especially when I did this. I'm talking like this is a big piece of some shit, but mm -hmm. sometimes you just gotta. When you catch the bug to do it, you just gotta be like, fuck it. Mm -hmm. Yo, where they at? Let me do it now. Because if I don't do it now, God knows when the next time I'm gonna do it. And that's what happened yeah. with this. Willa hit me and was like, yo, the tattoo artist is about to be in town. He's about to come to the crib. Because um, his wife's tattoo artist is from Jamaica. Yeah. So he comes to New York. I was York. about to ask you, like, how do you find yours? Yeah, he, come, he comes once a year to New York. So he decided to come down to New York for a month. So he, like, in demand like that? Yeah, he nice. Son of his boy's nice. He did Jason's whole arm. That's oh, yeah, did yeah, Jason. Jason's nice. Yeah. Right. So he was like, yo, he doing it now. He's going to be in New York. And he's going to be at the crib tomorrow. So I'm like, ah, right, you know what? Fuck it. If I don't do it now, mm -hmm. God knows the next time I'm going to do it. Fuck it. I'm going to do this. And I was like, if I feel good with this, then I'll do this. But... Ida did this today, started it, but he didn't have the time. Yeah. Because he's because he's only here for a month. Mm. Homie booked up. Too. Yeah, I bet you. So he because this is so small, he's like, yeah, I can do that. Twenty minutes. I bet you he comes here and makes bank for that month and then just bro, goes back. Bro, <laughs> that nigga, me. I I don't know. I don't even want to get in his business, but that yeah, because I know for a fact he was like, yo, tattoo artists could make at least you could make in a day, at least anywhere between one to two grand in yeah. a day. Yeah. And that's here in New York. Yeah. So, if I knew, if I knew, there's a lot of jobs. If I knew, mm -hmm. I would. I, I, yeah, I just started over and did yeah. one of them shit. Two grand a day, like barbers. I know barbers make money. There's no way a barber in New York don't make money. Yeah. How much heads is in New York City to cut? Mm -hmm. Shit. And you, if you're semi decent, man, listen. My barber make at least. Now that he went up, he makes at least off of me probably anywhere between one twenty five to one fifty a month. Me by myself. Mm. He could make at least a calm three, yeah. four thousand dollars a month if he's good. Yeah, I know a dude. I'm just like he. Uh, what's it called? He's the guy who actually did. He's the guy who first cut my hair when I got my dress cut off. Mm. But like he cuts. Uh, what's his name? Idris Elba's hair. Um, he cuts like he does this shit for like the stars and stuff like that. Mm. And he's actually starting his own film company. He started his own film production company. Pretty mm -hmm. soon, it's, it's called Director's Cut. <laughs> 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 yeah, but it's a super dope guy. And uh, oh, what up? What up? Wow. What up? Oh my lord! What up? Hello, fellas. Can you blur this out too if I show you? <laughs> Wait, yeah. huh? Yeah. Do you see this? No, you have a privacy screen. Do you see this? Oh yeah, I see it. Cause he's a thought leader. No, I'm absent. Yeah, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. Right. Jesus Christ. Right, is someone letting people know we're going to be here? Uh, yeah, we could. Oh, oh, my Lord, Jesus. Child of God. How far oh, is Jay? I don't know. Uh, can I? Uh, I'm yeah, about to have a hate heart attack. Why? Because it's just. Yeah. What do you got for dinner tonight? Chinese. <laughs> oh. All right, all right. I got, right, a, right, I got right. a mad lady. Ta is, is Taz. They yeah. running late too. She hit me. 
happened? What the bro? Because well, now because I'm abstinent, I'm getting more and more things sent to my phone out of the blue that I wasn't normally expecting them to get. Of course, that's how it that works. And yeah, Jesus Christ, Charlie, okay. Yeah. All you gotta do is act like you don't want something. And that's what no, but doing. I really don't want something, <laughs> and I feel like it's bothering me though. How you going, Ray? Right? Oh, you still recording, right? Yeah. Are you just recording stuff? Yeah, it's small talk, man. Because you niggas be late. Yeah, we want to talk about shit. No, we talking about bad shit. You know what I'm saying I, I'm not hitting on shit because I'm running late. Uh, <laughs> my fault. Watch your hands. Nah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Sound better than that? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, hold up. Turn to a little. Turn this. Turn this one. Got you a little rock in your ear. Oh, yeah. I was telling you. Well, I have one. Old oh, school. You remember one? <laughs> <laughs> I'm from that era. <laughs> like, I was just like, hold up, I'm not in the other game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I'm from that era, bro. When I was younger, um, if you had it on well, no, one, I know that's a, that was a thing. Well, it's, it's but it's two things. In Chicago, it's gas straight, you know, yeah, but it's know, also that's everywhere. but it's also game bank. So so it's according to what side you used to rap. You know what I'm saying? And, and I wasn't a game banger, but it's game bank culture. So you have to pick the side that you like. So yeah, this one. In Jamaica too, as men, if you pierce both your ears as a man in Jamaica, you go to a gay. Yeah, not that close. Like, so that's, that's, that's the same. That's it, boys. Yeah, 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 like for real. So. And then if you did pierce it, Jamaica, a lot of Jamaican men now who do double piercings. So they. So they still have two, but it's in one. Yeah. Wow, that's the thing I miss. I miss having my gauges. You do? Oh, yeah, that's right. They tore I remember happened. you said that. Yeah, because a lot of people, because I have long hair, didn't, didn't, even, see didn't even know I had big, I had big gauges. Yeah, I remember. Yeah. I, remember. Yeah. I had big gauges. What people don't know is called. I, I, told, I think I'm pretty sure I told you. Guys. Yeah, what did you say? What happened? Yeah, I had the surgery or whatever. Oh, I'm so like, so like, one of them ripped. Yeah, you told us. Yeah, yeah. Which yeah. Is one of them ripped or whatever. And then I had like a, my wife says, you have plastic surgery. I'm like, I didn't have plastic surgery. <laughs> I was just like, what they did was they... They took the good part and kind of fused it. Like, I didn't know you could do, do that. that. They do that. They can do that. With but I already hit it, it, ears don't heal. Like they do. like a nose. Like you can't heal if you break it. Well, no. It, something like that. Like cartilage doesn't grow back. Something like that. It doesn't grow back, it's but it can. Way. But the skin around it can heal. Oh, okay, okay. I'm doing something like that. Yeah. I'm like, so like they couldn't. So like if I wanted to, because for example, like they had to cut off part of my earlobe. Damn. And then and then and then stitch it to like stitch it to like the side of my face. Wow. Yeah. It's just like my ear looks normal. Like my ear just looks like it's a small ear now. But if you look at this other ear, you can tell that. Like, oh this one, shit! Yeah, like you know. Why I go back? Yeah. Oh, like my damn man. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I look like it. That's what I'm saying. Most people, you can tell it doesn't look like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. I didn't even peep. It's yeah. mad short. <laughs> yeah. Okay. We got two different ears. Yeah, but I was like, I wasn't gonna be one with one massive gauge on one side. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was like, that looks fucking silly, but. Wow. But like I had like this whole because like I had like the whole plan like I was like hey, when I cut my hair at least I'll still have these gauges like right. I wanted that that was your look yeah, yeah I wanted that look and that shit pissed what me off you, you, like you know how that goes sometimes but you know but, he, but you know I almost felt like it was like okay if you're gonna make this big change it's gonna be this whole big change so I was mm-hmm. just like all right you know how that goes so I talked it up to that yeah you know is you say you pass a nose thing all right cool so we'll be all right. That means he's like five minutes away now. We started to turn the team.